Hi. Uh, today we're going to discuss uh, chords in the F major scale. So the F major scale, uh, starting from the F, the low middle C. I'm going to have it to B flat. You have your F major chord, F A C, then A C F, first inversion, C F A, second inversion, root position, first inversion, second inversion, and then take it up again. And that's also root position. This is root position, an octave higher, both for root position. Now, also, the other two major chords within the F major scale is you have the B flat major chord and the C major chord. Ah, see, isn't it interesting that uh, because you have shared notes you at the time have chords that will be in more than one scale. The C major is of course you'll find that C major scale but also it exists in the F major scale. So going from F A C then C E G then back to the F. C, and then I can go up top there. And of course, reviewing for uh, first inverse, uh, sorry, root position, C, E, G, first inversion, E, G, C, and second inversion, G, C, E. First inversion, root position. So, uh, in playing between the, t the two, um, again in one of the uh, previous exercises, I talked about where you could where you can make your transition between chords instead of jumping. I can go make a smoother transition by going F A C root position. Then because I have we have a common tone between the two chords, which is C, F A C and C E G, I can keep that note on top, the C, and play the uh, first inversion and then go back to the F chord. F major, C first inversion, C major, then back to the F. Or another way I could play it if I was playing that started with the F on the second inversion. Then I can go to the root position. Notice I'm keeping my thumb with the C. C E G. Then back to C F A. And then another way I could play this. If I start on the uh, first inversion on the F, and then keeping the C, I switch to that. Some people might want to play the third finger. It might be a little awkward. I like using the fourth finger there. For G, C, E, and then back to F. Second inversion, back to the F. Second inversion, then first inversion with F. Now the other chord is the B flat major. So and so you play B flat, D, and then F. The Peggio, then together. Again, so this is the first inversion, 
second version, G, F, B flat. I don't know the fourth finger, but you can use your pinky there. And then the um, second version, F, B flat, D. Together. Then back to the uh, first version. Back to the position. B flat D F. Let's play a little faster. chords together and so playing root position F A C B flat D F I'll pull it up so you can see a little better then C E G Now, uh, like I said before, if you want to have a smoother uh, transition between the um, chords, playing the one four five B, uh, sorry uh, F B flat C, I'm starting root position. I can switch to the uh, first inversion of the B flat major chord because it shares. Remember common tone. I can just switch those fingers. Each one going up over one, and then going down, playing E, G, C, then back to the root position there. Take it up higher. C, F, B flat, D, then E, G, C, okay, and then we're going to do the similar thing with the uh, left hand, okay, same notes there. There you go. And so that was uh, working on a progression of 1, 4, 5 in the key of F. Uh, we just did that one particular way of playing it. And I'll show you some uh, other ways in uh, the next uh, video. Okay, wish you all the best in your musical studies.